Well, it's hard to even think about, but the deadly duck boat accident in Missouri could have killed a Lexington High School football player. Frederick Douglass sophomore Jaden Coleman lost nine members of his family in that accident, and he would have been on that trip if it weren't for football practice. So now his team and the community are showing their support for him and his family. LAX 18's Carolina Buchek is live at City Barbecue on Richmond Road, where they're raising money to help. Every year, Jaden Coleman would go on his annual family trip, but this year, luckily, he stayed behind because he didn't want to miss too much football practice, and that actually may have saved his life in this situation, but he did lose so many others. So to help here at City Barbecue, every order, 25% will be taken off and given to his family. Lunch, full chicken sandwich, cornbread, mac and cheese, and collard greens. Every delicious order at City Barbecue through the rest of July will help out. And the community is wasting no time. After football practice, the Frederick Douglass Broncos came to support one of their own, Jaden Coleman. We were all stunned that something like that would happen and so tragic and so many man family members. Coleman lost aunts, cousins, and his main father figure, his grandfather Horace, in the duck boat accident. And he found out about all of it during practice on Friday. He was at practice on Friday. His mom came there, and, and uh, we had to pull him out and tell him there. So it was a tough, it was a tough deal. This tragedy hits other groups as well, like Gray Construction. Today, they came to pick up a big lunch order because one of their co-workers is also related to the family and currently grieving. One of our HR coordinators, is actually cousins of the family and so it was her uncle's family that lost nine of their family members on the boat accident. So this out-of-state accident hits close to home and the Broncos football family wants to help. All of his brothers on the team have rallied around him and been there supportive for him. Uh, tough times are ahead. He's got you know some things to deal with this weekend with the services and then he'll join and rejoin the team next week and and again, we'll be there for him and, and we'll move forward and like all families should. And earlier today, many of Coleman's teammates came out here for lunch. More are expected to show up for dinner. And it wasn't just the football team. Other athletic teams from the school were here as well earlier today inside. It was a sea of green and orange, the school colors for the Broncos. Covering the news live in Lexington from the LEXC T-Mobile newsroom, back to you. Great to see everybody pitching in oh, to yeah. help that young man and his family.